Hi, and welcome to the fourth video of the Spegim IQ tutorial series. I'm Gaela, and in this video we will go through the device catalog. Let's get started. The Spekim IQ catalog is the place where data is stored and visualized. It allows you to manage and examine your data and to add tags and descriptions to your datasets. Let's take a closer look at the catalog. To go to the catalog view, open the device menu with the sets button. To choose catalog, press the button again and the most recently recorded dataset will be visualized on the screen. From this view, you can press custom for to open the catalog thumbnail view, where you can easily scroll to see all of the data recorded on the memory card. The dataset name tells us directly the date when the data has been recorded and the data recording mode that has been used. Let's select the dataset that we wish to examine further. On the right hand side, you can see three tabs Research, Tag, and Info. At the moment, we are on the Research tab, where you can examine the spectrum of different pixels by touching the pixel on the screen. To enlarge the spectrum graph, tap it on the screen. To minimize the graph again, tap it again. This view has some additional functions if you have recorded your data either with an application or by using the automatic screening mode. Let's take a look at these functions. Here we can see data recorded with my application that has four classes and an additional option to view all of the classes in one image. You can change the classes by pressing custom one or by choosing the class directly on the touchscreen. With custom two button, we can toggle between different results and backgrounds. As a default, we can see the class mask over the spectral image. Pressing custom 2, the class masks are removed and we can see only the spectral image. Pressing the custom 2 again will show us the viewfinder color image and a fourth press, only the class mask on top of a black background. Further presses will start to visualize these results in the same order all over again. To help examine the data better, you can zoom into the picture by pressing custom 3 and out again by pressing custom 4. When you zoom into the picture, the spectrum graph is minimized, but you can restore it by touching the menu icon on the right side of the screen. You can also navigate around the image while zoomed in by dragging your finger on the screen or by using the navigation buttons. To change the pixel selection, simply touch another part of the image. To remove the selection, press the X in the selection symbol. When zoomed in, pressing and holding the custom 4 button will return you to the full view. Let's move forward to the tags view. You can assign several material tags to specific pixels in the data or global tags that label the full dataset. These tags work as your personal notes. When importing the data to IQ Studio, the tags are important alongside the data. To add a new global tag, tap the Add Global Tag button. Type in the tag and press Save. Saved global tag appears on the tags list. To add a material tag, touch a pixel in the image on the touchscreen. Study the spectrum and if necessary, zoom in with custom 3 to verify the source. Once you have the correct pixel selected, select add material tag from the touchscreen. Type the name for the tag and press save. On the Info tab, you can review some of the dataset details, edit the description text, 
and delete the dataset from the catalog. Tap the dataset info on the right side of the screen to view the following details of the image. The dataset name, the data recording mode or the name of the application used to capture the data, the integration time used to capture the data, the size of the dataset, the recording date and time, and a description of the dataset. If you have recorded data with an application, such as in this dataset, the text will be shown as it has been defined in the application creator in the Speckim IQ software. Press the OK button to close the window. You can edit the description of the dataset by tapping the Edit Description button. Make the desired changes and press Save. If you wish to exit the view without changes, simply press the Back button. To delete the dataset from the camera's catalog, tap the Delete button. Confirm the selection by pressing Delete using the Touch button or from the Set menu button. The dataset is now removed from the memory card. In this tutorial, we introduced you to the Speckim IQ's catalog. If you found this video useful, do give it a like and please subscribe to the Speckim Spectral YouTube channel to follow our tutorial series on the Speckim IQ. See you in the next video.